Yes, I'm on unpaid furlough, so that means that we hope to get paid. We've been told we cannot work, even if we wanted to take work home. We've been threatened and told that you can be arrested, jailed, uh, suspended, or fined $5,000 if we work, if we use a government device, if we check our email, check our phone messages, nothing. So we can't even work, and I often take work home. I'm, I mean, I'm a PhD scientist. I think a lot. I want to do my work. I want to do my work, which is for the American consumer, which helps the American farmers who are right here. I mean, I'm a USDA scientist. So right here you have people that are growing America's crops that are now sitting in silos and not going where they're supposed to go, which a lot of it's China. And he's paying the farmers off. He's not paying us. Is this right? They still at least have a job. They can still go to a conference, but I can't. an unpaid employee if he will indeed pay us you know he's tweeted already I'm not maybe I'll take that money for the federal workers and pay for my wall why don't you take the money you bailed the farmers out with 12 billion and pay for your wall or your 60 billion excess money for the military that's doing nothing and pay for your wall if you have to have a wall do it some other way and just put America back to work and Positive, very, we're very supportive of what he's done. He's done, like, like the president said, he has done more for farmers than any president in, in my lifetime. And I've been, uh, I've been, I came back to the farm in '74. He talked about the border wall, which we support 100%. Uh, we talked about trade. And although trade has, has hurt us personally a little bit because we were exporting to China, and uh, it caught the, the because of the trade, we was able to move our product, but it the price was down a little bit for a little while because of the trade. But but because of other uh, market factors, it didn't hurt us that much, and so we we were okay okay with it. But we do support him in his trade negotiation. We really supporting with the trade negotiations with New Mexico, or Mexico and Canada because, like I say, those, those deals were not fair and, and he's done a lot to help us. He's done a, a tremendous a lot with, with, the, with the trade, with the WOTUS. That was a big deal. The, the EPA was, and regulations and the water deal was, it was going to really do, do big damage to us and limit our, our ability to farm and to ranch, you know, to, to do what we've always done. 